folk. We're here in Detroit. Uh, just got through, got underway this morning in uh, you know, free practice. Uh, it was a good first session, just reviewing some footage. And uh, the track's going to be good tonight. It's going to be a little shorter, but uh, incredible dirt. And uh, we're finally in a dome, so uh, have consistent weather all night. So it'll be exciting. So Psh, who's pumped for Supercross? You know. For real. My guy Bryson on the wrenches. Look at him. Bam. I guess the timing loop was messed up. Yeah, that's what they said was the, the timing of scoring was off. They were the first practice we were just sitting there. And it came on the radio and said something because Vincent told us. There's not just freaking 45 people. Yeah, you probably got about 20 minutes. Yeah. Get warm for a second. supposed to be 920 but it's already 905 there's no way they're out there right now Bryson we'll uh whenever you're done we'll check sag and we'll go back up there I know they're running late but that way oh, we're not late days, so. we're not like scrambling as as Bryce would say we don't want to be caught with our pants down yeah yeah <laughs> never get that <laughs> Right. How was that at those That's, settings? That that everything seemed pretty good out there. The dirt's pretty dang good right now. Okay. So um, not a whole lot hard out there. You know? No, no, so, no, no. Like like as far as like the type of dirt, I think is good for tire and setup so far. Good. So. Okay. Uh, plenty of drive off the rear. I, I believe so, yeah. I never okay. caught myself losing rear end traction or anything like that. It was all pretty pretty good, both front to rear. So. Okay. And then the front, no uh, tucking in or pushing I didn't. I didn't notice any, no. Okay. No. So, like I was referring to down there, that, that was a lot of that was mainly um, more flat. Mm -hmm. oh, where you put it. But it, for what the track is, it was, it was good. So. We'll see. It should be. It should be a little rougher. It's starting to probably harden up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So we'll see after the first fall time. Okay. Where we're at. Sounds good. Hey. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Set a time lapse up right here and check out the street. Dude, go ride that beta. Okay. And uh, so I was with all the 180s, I don't think that's a bad thing at all. Yeah, like Unless the it. rhythm starts to get kind of poorly. Because uh, that's the one thing I'm more, like, with that setup, I'm more hesitant about is just pushing, in. pushing into rhythms and stuff. Yeah. Because it has this, it's a, push a with the shock, but it has a little bit front end dominant sense. lower? Yeah. Okay. So, we'll just see how this next practice is. Yeah. So. Um, what did the what was the low or the the high speed at the rebound? I was gonna check the sack. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me get my helmet. Okay. okay.
But we had a different setup. Yeah. Yeah, different on the forks. I almost hate to go more. More. I don't want it to sit more like that. Yeah. Hit that 105. Yeah. Hmm. And it could have been like by either way, just where it settles to. So you could go up either way. I think when Bryce does, he usually kind of like pulls up a little bit and lets it kind of settle. What was it before you were pulling up on it? Uh, it was. 107. Really? Were you pulled up? Like four pulled up. Damn, it's kind of low. Yeah, so we can. Does it feel like it's high when you're riding? We just compared to what I was riding this week. Yeah, it's just like four feet. Yeah, I feel it feels front end heavy. Does it? Hmm. I'm thinking, uh. I wouldn't want to be past 105. No. Let's <laughs> see kind of like how it's turning. Yeah. If I feel like it, then we'll go that way. But, man, I hate to be, I have a hard time lowering the sag number in. Yeah. Or it feels like Yeah. Yeah, for sure. You hear me? This one doesn't feel as bad as the other one. Really? It's probably because of force. It's taking more load off of it. Yeah. Yeah. Because the other one, I was kind of like, you could it's really kind of dangerous it. feeling. Really? Yeah. Really yeah. poppy. What? Ooh. Yeah. I just know what the our practice stuff is like. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, got a little comparison going on with their, those okay. numbers are at. That works for me. Set. Probably gonna be a good weekend. I can just I can just feel it. Just because Bryson came, it's gonna be good. So, uh, state qualifiers in about an hour, so it's fueling up. 
peanut butter man eats some peanut butter. So we ready. Pink headphones. Oh, I forgot I had these. Yeah, I was just getting these off the counter. Forgot about them. I'm just thinking about what I want to do because um, track's a little different than where we practice, just establish a little bit more comfort in the front end. So just gathering my thoughts from the practice and uh, so I can inform my crew, my team, and they can uh, help guide us and get this motorcycle even better. Yeah, I, I, I like I like that better as a little was a little a little firmer in the rear, a little stiffer with low speed, uh, high speed rebound. Yeah. I like that better. The forks are a hard one though. It feels like the rear doesn't match shock. Really? Yeah. Like yeah. The, the especially now that it's getting rough. Yeah. Um, and you're really using the bike, pushing it and getting it. Uh, I kind of back to that. Like I don't know where the front, where the bike's gonna go. Okay. Like I'm jumping into stuff. And it's, pushing out. Yeah. Um, I don't know if that's a stiffness thing. I don't know. I don't really know what to do with that. To be really honest with you, um, kind of pulls, pulls me around. So like even in the whoops, the back that's just night and day better in the rear and the back. Better. But now it's overpowering. The, like the front isn't doing its job. Like too soft. Maybe. Okay. I, I don't know. Okay. I know at Anaheim yeah. when we went stiffer on the fork. Yeah. It made it worse around the track as far as roughness, feedback in your hands, and it had the same action. The same action. Yeah. It was just harsher. Okay. It was. Uh, uh. Okay. So this isn't Anaheim. Yeah. But uh, it's just what I. Okay. The only thing I have to go off of. Okay. So I don't know what. Did it almost make the front end feel light? The back. Thanks. It just makes the front end feel like I can't trust what it's going to do, where I'm going to go with it. Okay. Um, like it feels like it's down. It's down the like I feel like I'm at like 12 millimeters right. based on the ride height. Okay. But I definitely like the stiffer shock. Okay. Stiffer. Yeah, that was better. Not better. Did, you, did it feel like your time here? And like I don't think that's a sag feature. I think that's quality of the fork, maybe the right height. Yeah. It rides low. Okay. Just assuming, just kind of piecing things together. Better. I'd like to think it would. I know that's a practice track. Being where it wasn't smooth. Yeah. It was like fucking like. Battery. So I just don't know what it's gonna would do out there. I hate to put it on and be like, let's go, dirt bike! Yeah. We can more changes. Yes. So we can kind of boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Okay, my feet are cold. Let me on the ground. Oh, back. Oh, back. Oh, back. Oh, back. He's silly. Uh oh, Fiji water. Yo, qualifying's over here in uh, Detroit. Uh, feel a lot more comfortable today. Feel racy. Um, I don't know what I qualified at the times, but. Uh, uh, it's a good day. Got to be grateful. Got uh, my family here, and we're having some fun. So, uh, looking forward to some heat racing later, and hopefully being that main event. Uh, Taylor did something. Uh, so he softened it, did something to rebound, and it made it a little more compliant because it was stiffer, had more hold up. But it was, yeah, Tyler. But it was like when I jump into the corners and stuff, it was bouncing me back. And the front
front and he did something to help with that, I'd like to go more. Okay. Like, I wouldn't be afraid to go more in front of this. Okay. Because that was good. So I'll go yeah, all good. Ooh, about to get on that ass. <laughs> That's a wrap here in Detroit. Uh, this is the main event, but uh, we did make some good progress. Motorcycle felt awesome this weekend. Data guys, data guys did a great job getting me comfortable and uh, rode a lot better this weekend. Really had uh, some good times and uh, yeah, we had a lot of fun. Just uh, really isn't fun not racing main event. So uh, that's that's my ultimate goal is to really work work on the starts and uh, the first few laps. And, uh, nothing new, but I uh, keep working the puzzle. So uh, that's where we're at. That's Detroit.